Hi, this is Tech Guy from the Hive bringing you the last but not least unboxing uh, for this week of unboxings. Uh, this is going to be the Quilter's Candy Box. We're going to go ahead and dive right into this in, uh, in the Beehive tonight. Uh, so, just kind of a side note, I've already done this box once. Uh, I've already filmed it and when I started editing it, I didn't have any sound. So you would have saw my lips moving and bringing out some of the notions out of the box, but I had no sound. So I'm going to go ahead and scrap it, but we're going to go ahead and do it again. So thank you for joining me tonight. Uh, the first thing that comes into the box, it was wrapped with a pink tissue paper with a with a sticker on it, which is pretty cool. That's their normal thing. It's kind of like opening a present. So the first uh, thing that I'm going to pull out here is the October's Quilters Candy Box. It's going to have five different uh, items inside the box. I'm going to place this off to the side, uh, kind of reference this later, kind of do a review, a recap. So the pattern that you get inside this box is called Trixie. Uh, it has different types of fabric requirements on depending on what size you want. It has a baby, it has a throw, uh, a twin and queen size uh, instructions, which is pretty cool. I like the pattern, it's very bright, and if I would imagine, this is what the fabric is gonna look like through here. So we're gonna get to the fabric pretty soon. So pretty cool. It's Trixie and it's made by Hello Melly Designs, uh, pattern 116. Cool thing that came in the box is a wooden block with a heart on it, which I know Kia would definitely, definitely like. It's by Just Add Sunshine, and they're out of San Diego, California. Um, I think their actual company is called Just Add Sunshine Incorporated. It was a pretty cool block. Comment below if you've got a different block or you receive the same block. I kind of always want to know what kind of variations they do with each block. So. That's pretty cool. I know she'll put this somewhere in her studio. And this was kind of placed inside of this bag, kind of see-through bag, kind of cool. Quilter's candy box in the front. And then it has like an enameled pin here. It says, say sweet. Reminds me of old uh, stamps. Here has a strawberry in the front. This is one of two. So comment below if you get the second one or this is the first one that came out and it's part of the collector set, but that's pretty cool. I know Kia would definitely like that. And then when you collect them, you can place them in the bag. And of course, you can't have a Quilter's candy box without the candy or the treat or something uh, sweet and savory. This is like a mini pecan pie. Never had one in my life. Uh, look forward to eating it. Uh, old fashioned pecan pie. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So, and then we've got the business card for the Just Add Sunshine Incorporated. They have a Etsy shop, an Instagram, a website, an email, all through the business card or on the business card that came with the block. Now, the last thing is, of course, the fabric, which is pretty cool. I won't. I don't know what the measurements are because I haven't read the fully the uh, the card yet. But there's your pinks, kind of cool design. And then you've got a different type of pink with windows, with shutters, things like that. And then you've got a white background with blue flowers. You can see that. And then you've got a blue background with blue leaves, red buds, things like that. And this is pretty cool. It has a bunch of instruments on here, the blue background. Definitely like it. It's called Angles or Sonata, sorry, Sonata on this. So pretty cool, this is the fabric that you get. So referring back to the card, so it's actually five half yard cuts. Pretty cool, I think that's a good amount of fabric. And then it comes with the exclusive uh, pattern with the Hello Melly Designs, which is the Trixie one that we showed earlier. And then a Stay Sweet Enamel Pin right here with the bag that came through. And then a custom one-of-a-kind wooden sewing machine block right here. So that's pretty cool. But yeah, comment below if you got a different block or a different design. And then of course, not but not least, 
last but not least, the pecan pie, which I'm excited to try. And then at the bottom of this uh, sheet, it says, post your photo of your Quilter's candy box to win next month's box for free. And see the website to see last uh, last month's box winner. I think Kia was on a video with me with the Quilter's candy box, and I think there was like something crazy, less than like 50 people actually did a photo and one of them won. So you've got a really good chance of winning um, for something that you can win for free by posting your current Quilters candy box. So that's pretty cool. I did enjoy the box this month. Uh, if you have any comments, questions, uh, please post them below. Uh, I would love to continue the conversation with y'all. And thank you for uh, helping me conclude this week of unboxings uh, at the Hive today. Uh, but if you have any questions, please comment below. If you are not a subscriber yet, please subscribe, and I'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Bye.